Hey everyone, I'm Wes. I'm Kathleen. And today we're going to be building a super simple summertime water project. If it were up to our kids, we would spend every day in the car wash and we would just keep going through it over and over and over. So instead of washing our cars till the paint falls off, we're bringing the car wash back home. It's called the Kids Car Wash Sprinkler and you can walk, run, or ride through it. And the best part is you can put it together, take it apart, store it for the winter time, and use it again. Well, let's get started. During our last trip to Lowe's, we picked up PVC pipes, a hose adapter, a tee fitting, and a few PVC connector pieces. These are all basic materials we use to construct the bones of our car wash. First step is measure our PVC. I'm going to cut it with this hacksaw. We'll make sure to leave all the specific cutting dimensions for you in the description below. Next, I'm going to clean up the edges so we get a nice tight fit. We're going to take one of our 60 inch PVC pieces, we're going to cut four inches off so we can insert our T. Next, we're going to prime the edges so we can cement the T together. Now this is the only cementing we're going to do so we can take it apart later. Wes is drawing a straight line down our 60 inch pipes. We're going to mark every 4 inches and then drill holes. Do your best to drill straight holes. The straighter the holes are, the straighter the water will come out. So we want to plug the ends of our 60 inch pieces to maximize the water pressure where the water sprays out. To do this, we're going to cut two 3 inch pieces off this dowel rod and we're going to use silicone caulk to plug the ends. Now that all the pipe is prepped, it's time to put it all together. build is done, it's time to accessorize. We went through Lowe's and found some things that we felt like would work. We got this mop head and some pool noodles, some sponges. You can get really creative with this. Well, Wes, what do you think? Uh, looks a little small for me, but perfect for the kids. This project packs a lot of bang for a little buck. So if you decide to build this for your little rider, let us know how it turns out in the comments. And for all the tools, steps, and materials you'll need, check out the description below. Thanks for watching and good luck.